Automobile handling describes how the vehicle responds to a driver's inputs as it moves along a track or road, how it performs during cornering, acceleration, and braking, as well as the vehicle's directional stability. How the driver handles the vehicle is the most common factor in approximately 90% of all crashes. Mechanical failure is responsible for only about 10%. There are only two things you can do while driving. Change speed. Change direction. You have three main vehicle controls. Steering wheel. Gas pedal. Brake pedal. In the automotive industry, handling and braking are the major components of a vehicle's active safety. Without a mechanical failure, cars do not lose control by themselves. It is often the driver out of control, in a sense. Successfully handling an emergency situation can involve making good decisions based on factors such as road and traffic conditions, evasive maneuvering, proper hand placement and seating position, skid control, steering and braking techniques, understanding vehicle dynamics, the more experience a person has with a car or type of car, the more likely they will take full advantage of its handling characteristics under adverse conditions. Each model of car handles forces differently. The forces you should be aware of and understand are Friction is a force that arises when things rub together. The frictional force between the road and tire allows the tire to push off the road, thus moving the car forward. Friction is also very important when a car goes around a turn. If the friction between the road and tires is insufficient, the vehicle will slide sideways off the road instead of turning the corner. Traction is the friction between a wheel and the road surface. If you lose traction, you lose road grip. Momentum Builds as the car is moving. When you are driving, both you and your vehicle have acquired momentum. The faster you go, the more momentum is built up. Therefore, more counterforce, meaning braking or downshifting, will be required to slow down. Speed can be defined as the distance traveled by an object over a certain amount of time. Whereas momentum is the mass of an object x its velocity. When you need to slow down or stop, you will need to decrease your vehicle's momentum by using the friction force of your brakes by applying them. Using the friction force between your tires and the road is done automatically. Using the compression force of your engine by switching to a lower gear. Centrifugal Forces upon the car when its drive path is changing. Changing direction causes the vehicle's weight to shift to the outside of the turn, Centrifugal force is affected by the vehicle speed and the angle of turn. Changing direction causes the vehicle's weight to shift to the outside of the turn, which, unless the driver controls its speed, can lead to the vehicle rolling over or sliding out. Gravity The invisible force that pulls all things to the earth. Gravity significantly affects your vehicle when you are driving downhill or uphill. Gravity's power is working against you when you are going uphill, pulling your car in the opposite direction and slowing down your vehicle. You will need more engine power to stay with the flow of traffic. Weight Transfer The vehicle's weight is constantly shifting every time you brake, accelerate, and turn. There are three ways that weight transfers can occur. Acceleration Weight transfers to the rear when accelerating. Some traction is lost at the front wheels. If acceleration is aggressive, there will be a noticeable rise in the front of the vehicle and a drop in the rear. Deceleration. When a car brakes, the front tire's downward load increases and that on the rear decreases. Traction is lost at the rear wheels. If braking is hard, there is a noticeable drop in the front of the vehicle and a rise in the rear. Occupants feel forward movement. Apply too much pressure, and the wheels may lock up, resulting in a loss of traction and directional control. Avoiding dramatic shifts in weight due to aggressive driving is vital for your safety. 
Practicing smooth driving daily will make the journey more pleasant for your passengers and allow you to cover the ground more quickly and safely.